Hi, hello, and welcome back to some Akuma MC Prisons. I have been AFKing a lot, and I've been hard at work upgrading my AFK miner for today's video. I'll be getting into that in a little bit. Number one, I want to talk about my tokens and such. I've got a lot, and I haven't claimed all of what I have, because I do have a little bit there from AFKing just now, and I've also got some of that. Now, I've also got a bunch of openables. I'm gonna go ahead and slam through a bunch of these, uh, particularly these at first, and I'll figure out the rest in a little bit. My Shadow Clone is maxed out, I just now realized that. Well, we've got two more things to add to that, and that is Mead's Wrath and Night Fury. I'm gonna do the Tier 1 Crystal Boxes. Uh, I don't know if they're gonna give me anything good. Do I even have Crystals Unlocked, actually? I do have a rank up crystal. Well, I've got a lot of these gold mystery vaults. I think these are going to fill my inventory up. Actually, maybe not. I think I turned a lot of the rewards off. I did that for keys, by the way, and it is really good now. I can just, oops, slam through some keys and get basically nothing filling my inventory. I don't have room. Shadow clone. Wow, that's a lot of sh shadow clone. Uh, pet fragment. Ooh, wait, that's actually really good. You're my most leveled, so you know what? Let's just do that. Make you a masterful. Hell yeah. I'm gonna sort through these in my free time. That is gonna take way too long to open these, try and sort through them and all that. Too much time. Too damn much time. I'm not dealing with it. What I will deal with is showing you guys that one, I have 53Q, 629 million gems. I can go ahead and max out Napalm Strike very easily. I mean, th th that's it. I'm saving up for Guardian's Beam. Now, I want to go ahead and show you guys the work that I've done with the AFK dude. Um, and then we'll go ahead and actually use this fuel on him. Um, I did use five minutes of him. I didn't really see much of a difference in terms of money. Um, but you can see in minor upgrades, I've maxed out his wealth. I'm about to max out his efficiency. And I'm going to go ahead and max this out as well. Now, the problem is, that is a lot. Right there was just 10Q into him. I think I just get everything at this point. Like, I, I think I just max him out. Yeah, I might as well. Like, everything maxed out. I'm gonna hold on to this for a little bit longer. We're gonna do a little bit of mining before I actually test this guy out. I went ahead and voted. We got our boosters. Let me go and activate them. I'm gonna activate my pet, and I'm gonna get into some mining. So, oh, okay. Well, that's instant, so that's great. Um, my pickaxe is maxed at the moment. Every single enchant that I have, other than my gem enchants, are maxed out. Although that doesn't really leave me with much goals right now, because uh, like I said, all of my enchants are maxed. I need to get to 175 before I get a brand new enchant, and that is a ways away. I do still need to also upgrade my armor, because I do have some gem armor with a, zero, or a 0 0.05 times boost on gems, but it's not a lot right now. 400 orbs, and I can upgrade this. I'm not that far off. Shadow Clone activated again? Yo, that's massive. It's kind of weird not really having anything to lean into. I don't really know what to fill the void with. You know, it's I'm, I'm just kind of here. I could go to the AFK area, but I'd have to spend 24 Q tokens on robots, which would get me a lot more in return. So am I doing that? Or am I mining forever until I hit 175? Well, I think you already know the answer. I'm probably just gonna do that. Because that sounds like a lot more fun than trying to grind 10 more pickaxe levels. Oh, I actually got a piece of fuel. So you know what? I don't even have to stand there for 30 minutes. I can show you guys 5 minutes of it, which is actually super awesome. That's why I like Fuel Finder and why I would definitely recommend you wait until you get this enchant unlocked before you start worrying about the AFK miner, because other than that, you're gonna have to spend like 100 trillion uh, on fuel and it's just not worth it. Now, one thing I do have to do first, like I said, is spend all of my tokens. I'm just gonna put all of it into this, I will put a bunch of it into that, I'll put some of it into that, and a little bit into that. Now, I've got 29 billion left. I'm not sure if this is going to get me residual of the uh, little bit I did use, because I did use, uh, a, I think, a five-minute fuel to test him out, just to see uh, on the lower levels how uh, efficient he was. I didn't notice much of a difference, but I've got a five-minute fuel. I think it's going to give me a huge boost in tokens, which in that case, I'm going to step out, spend them, and then step back in. Let's see. It shorted. Yeah, no, that, uh, that was instantly one and a half Q tokens. Personally, I wish he would just save up tokens and you would just be able to pull them out of his inventory manually. 
even if he doesn't have fuel in him, but currently that's not how he works. So let me go ahead and spend all of these tokens again. You can see on the side, I'm going up like a couple hundred billion every like every little swing he does, which is absolutely insane. Now that's going to be affected by this enchant a little bit. This and this are the main ones, but this has a chance of activating, a 10% chance. These are both 100% chance. Keys occasionally. Treasure Hunter will give us some random uh, vaults and caches. And then Fuel Finder is the big one for me because it's a chance for him to get more fuel, which I think just resets the timer on it. As you can see, actually, he's now got 10 minutes from 5 minute fuel. So it's a really good enchant. It definitely gets more out of it. And I think at this point, what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to stand here. Oh, a key. I'm going to stand here for a bit, let him run for like 8 minutes, and we'll just see roughly how much he gives us. He he refreshed his time. I was literally in the middle of my spiel about how I was going to go downstairs and, and, and get a drink while this did its thing, and he, he got even more time. Guys, it, oh my god! Okay, so I haven't been here too long, I don't think. Last I left, there was 18 minutes on it. There's about five, uh, 15 minutes on it which is not too bad, but you can see just how insane this guy is. Like, he got fuel on his own, reset his time up from 5 minutes, all the way up to 18 at one point. And on the side, I've got 150, uh, 155 trillion tokens. That is insane. But the problem is, I have to cover, like, at least 30 to 35 tr uh, not trillion, uh, quadrillion? I don't know if he's going to be worth it in the end, but I'm going to try and figure that out. Now, one other thing I just realized I wanted to go in and actually check is how much it is for 100 trillion, because there is fuel for that, 10 minutes. So you would well over or well uh, clear the amount that you spent on it. But the problem I have with it is you have to pump a lot into it before you're even making 100 trillion back. Now I've got 205 trillion, which we know we can't do anything with because everything is fully maxed out on our pickaxe. The only thing that really isn't fully maxed out is our robots, but I now I need to save up in case I do hit 175 so that I can go ahead and uh, get some levels into the Guardian's Beam enchant, which is another really good enchant. We got milestones for tokens, but to be honest with you, I don't need the tokens. If I end up needing them, I'll claim them, but right now I don't really need them. I mean, I've got a maxed out miner, my pickaxe is maxed out, my AFK miner uh, is maxed out. Hey, the lads are here to help me mine. God, there's a lot of them. My goodness. They are demolishing this mine. I need a lot more gems. I also need like 60 more orbs and I can upgrade my gem armor, which is huge. Lottery got me 11 trillion tokens. Ooh, that's beautiful. It's a shame I just don't need it that bad. How much is it for the next level of Frozen Gorge? Did I even look? Oh, God. Oh, God. 51 million? Oh, dude, I gotta keep saving up more and more for it. I'm gonna try it for a bit. I'll at least try and aim for level 5. I'll see how I feel at level 5, but I don't even know if I'll get that far. We're at, like, what, level 2 right now? I do need it, just one more proc of Orb Finder, and I can go ahead and upgrade my gem armor. That is absolutely massive. I still am not sure if I'm going to get to the ultimate armor. I did get the proc, though. I got two procs there. Let's upgrade the armor. Bam. And it is, yes, a 10%. Is the, is the max going to be two times? Ugh, the, the amount's going to be insane for orbs. And the worst part is... There is no better way to get orbs. There's literally nothing I can do to make uh, make myself get orbs faster. Other than enchant proc boosters and stuff like that, which, you know what, I'm gonna go and activate one right now. I need 550 orbs for one more level, and that's gonna give me, like, I think another 5%, although it might go 10% this time. You know the worst part is? I have a lot of things to open, but a lot of things I'm gonna open are just gonna give me tokens. They won't give me gems, they won't give me pickaxe XP, they won't give me rank ups. But speaking of rank ups, wait, hold on, I only need six more? And then I hit 400. 171, just four more levels. And a little bit more for 400. I'm thinking a gem boost. Actually, you know what? Let's get some pickaxe XP boost, got one. I got a minute on this pet. I'm gonna go ahead and stop it early. 
and I'm gonna open a few things. I'm just gonna get through these opening, uh, op open, opening, openables, and, uh, and then I'll get back to mining a little bit, and, uh, try, try to make some good progress. Yeah, we'll open about 20 and see what happens. Oh my. Yeah, I should have probably expected that. That is a lot of pet eggs. I'm gonna save these for next time, those for next time, those for now. <laughs> Oh, man. Oh, man. Be ready to salvage all, because I'm gonna need to do it. That is insane. Last 10 Kial crates. That is gonna be a lot of more, uh, a lot more stuff uh, that I'm just gonna go ahead and salvage all real fast. And then I'll do a quick normal salvage so I can pick apart anything that I do also want to get rid of, such as the god ranks. And then we've got four VK crates. I'm gonna go and open up all four of these and see what they give me. Robots token booster to- I didn't even see any of that. Let me activate another one of these smaller boosters, and I'm assuming that you're already done anyway, so let's swap over to this guy for a little bit, for a little, like, four-minute mining session. Now I've got 2.68Q, which is pretty freaking sick. Did I get any coupons from any of those crates? I did, actually. I have $16 now. Uh, oh, hey, yo, Zeus's wrath? Nope, Zeus himself showed up to the party. Love that. I'm excited to see even more of how insane the AFK miner is. I want to take some screenshots to throw in the video to show you guys, because obviously I can't get the full effect of it without AFKing, but you saw like a little teaser of it. I'm going to try and do a little bit of that tonight. I'll, uh, I'll, you know, buy a certain amount of time, screenshot my tokens before and after, and do my best to, you know, give a rough estimate, because obviously... It's not going to be perfect, but you can at least go by the base amount that I spent. So if I spend 100 trillion tokens for 10 minutes of AFK time and end up with, like, a Q, you can at least say that there's a good chance that it's, you know, not going to be accurate to that every time. But you can say at least that you will make upwards of a Q, which is pretty insane. Or I guess up to a Q? I don't know the right wording. I need 67 tr uh, million. Now, last thing I want to go and do is robots token i want to go ahead and spend 3q on these guys and i'll spend the rest of it on my epics let me go ahead and also spend all of my uh gems between those two we now make let me make sure that's updated 10.8 million gems per hour and a total of 0.49q almost 500 trillion tokens an hour which is absolutely insane but that is it for this one i hope you guys did enjoy if you did leave a like and subscribe for more and i'll see you guys in the next one